Alright guys, Ivan here and yesterday RX Muscle YouTube channel uploaded an interview with Sean Ray. The topic was of course Sean Roden's guest appearance at Pittsburgh Pro. It's a 30 minute long rant and I enjoyed every single minute of it. I love listening to Sean Ray speaking and Dave has great questions and I encourage you guys, watch the video. I'm gonna leave the link down below if you haven't already watched it. Sean Ray is one of the most successful bodybuilders of all time. He was also a commentator the Mr. Olympia so many times. He knows his business, he knows what he's talking about, he has the expertise and he has the personality. So not only that he can provide great information, but he can actually make it enjoyable. So I definitely encourage you guys to watch that interview, but let me roll a little clip from it for you right now. I don't doubt that he's going to be in shape for the Olympia, but the question is some people were actually offended by how he looked and they said it wasn't professional for Mr. I Olympia was. to show up. Did you believe that too? Absolutely. I, dude, that was a total embarrassment. Listen. There's no excuse for that. You didn't come out of the hospital. Mm -hmm. um, just being off uh, and, hey, I don't start until May, then you know what? Take responsibility and keep your clothes on. At yeah. some point, you got to keep your clothes on and say no to some things. I listen, If I was a kid in the audience, I, you know, <laughs> my dad brings me and I'm going to see Mr. Olympia and I'm jacked up and this, this guy walks out? Come on. So Sean made a great point right there. He said it. If he's a Mr. Olympia and he looks like that in the offseason, he shouldn't present himself. He can do whatever hell he wants at home. He doesn't even have to promote the sport at all if he doesn't want to. That's his right. He can just stay home and chill with his family. But to actually promote the sport in a negative light like that, I just agree with Sean Ray. I agree that we cannot get used to this. Imagine if every Mr. Olympia ever looked like that in the offseason. Everybody would be so disappointed. That would be just horrible. That would be just mess. I don't want to see that. I don't know about you guys. Maybe you like it, but I don't like it. I don't like it at all. And I agree with Sean Ray. You should definitely watch the whole interview because he made a lot of great points. But there was another thing that he mentioned. And I'm going to play it right here for you. So let's watch this one as well. <laughs> and, and, and his excuses. Hey, you know, I start training for the Olympia in May. And, you know, I, I felt like I had to come out. And he's got the hat on. He's got the shoes on. Come on. And we wouldn't give Dorian Yates a pass. We can't get you. We cannot get used to this type of stuff. It was a 30 second routine. Right. I don't think there was one pose that he actually hit. Go back and watch it. <laughs> I mean, the front of my set was like, was he high? Like, <laughs> I could have sworn I was watching Homer Simpson high. So the first point that Sean Ray made right here is that he came up with excuses. He was saying that he just started to train, this and that, but nobody cares about that. We only care about it seeing him that way. Another point is that he didn't even have to show up. It's not in a contract or something like that. Maybe he's well paid for it, I don't know. But he didn't have to. He could have said something that he's not feeling well, that he's sick or something like that. He should have come up with something. It would probably be more responsible for a Mr. Olympia not to show up, to keep his clothes on. And another point is that he didn't even pose properly. He didn't hold the poses for longer than a part of a second, probably. So basically, that wasn't even posing. And also, he made a joke. He said that he looks like high Homer Simpson. And honestly, it does look like him a little bit. I don't know about you guys, but I can definitely notice some similarities. And not only the fat that he added, but also the facial resemblance. Do you see it? Because I do. <laughs> But seriously, guys, all jokes aside, what happened at this Pittsburgh Pro is wrong. It's not the best thing that happened for bodybuilding. Very unprofessional. Very unprofessional for a Mr. Olympia. For a representation of whole bodybuilding in the whole world. I don't like it. I don't like what I saw. And uh, I agree with Sean Ray with every single point that he made in this rant. So I encourage you guys to watch it. And tell me in the comment section below, what do you think? Do you agree with Sean Ray or you disagree with him? Just make sure to comment and don't forget to like the video as well and subscribe to my channel. All the best, guys. Bye-bye.